What is going on guys, Winter Kills here, and welcome to another Banless Reaction video. Yes, the official October 2021 Banless has been released as of just a couple hours ago. Windows, shut up! As I was saying, the official Banless has just gotten released, and uh, I unfortunately spoiled like a couple things. Um, I just happened to like scroll the notifications down on my phone, and I saw something in a group chat I'm in. So that was my fault, but everything else I'm completely blind on. And I was kind of like, the two cards were kind of like, yeah, I, I, I kind of saw that coming. So it's not really that big of a deal, but time to be utterly disappointed, everybody. Let's jump right into it. And here we are. The next update after this will be no sooner than January 17th. Okay. That's centered around some product or something. January 17th updated today uh let me let me f11 up in here so you guys can get the full screen experience but well, let's scroll down max c still ban a big one of these to every single person that thought that card was coming back nice try try again next time all right let's keep going let's keep going no fusions banned yep that was one of the things no no dragoon but credit plant a, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. So I'm expecting to see Heart of Plant, Verte, Anaconda. All right. So we're just going to keep... Did they ban anything? No Eva? No Herald of Ultimateness? Everybody's like, Ultimateness is going to get banned. I swear. Watch. They hit like Alpha or something. I swear, dude. The like Konami doesn't even pay attention. It's like they don't even play their own game. They just like throw darts at a wall. Or they look at the most upvoted thing on Reddit. Zodiac Barrage is now banned. Okay. A swift round of applause for Konami. You guys really address all of the problematic cards in this format. I, I was losing sleep over the fact that Barrage was still at one. And I just... I'm so relieved that it's now banned. Alright. Let's keep going. All the Exodia pieces are still at one. Okay, okay, okay. Eva is limited. This doesn't really do anything, but okay. Eva is limited. I only play one. Okay. Drytron players are chilling so long as I don't see an Alpha, Zeta. Okay, Meow Mew. That was on my list. That was on my list. That was on my prediction list. All right. So technically, I, I got two things right, technically. I said Eva was going to be banned. They were a little light with the Drytrons. They say limit Eva. I'm like, okay, that's fine. We take that. Frank Kids Meow Mew now limited. I think that's good. That severely hurts the grind game of the Frank Kids deck, which, let's be honest, it had an insane grind game, and the deck is really, really, really good. Ben 10 still limited. Okay, let's keep going here. Fire Formation, Tanky, okay, a little bit of a consistency slap to Tri Brigade and Zoo Dex alike. Same thing with Barrage going. So I, I like I, I like what I'm seeing so far. So one hit to Dry Charm, one hit to Pranks, two hits so far to the Tri Brigade deck. I like that quite a bit. Because Tri Brigade is the best deck. And anybody who thinks that Dry Tron is the best deck, I'm sorry, but you're just wrong. Um let's keep going here. So two two hits to consistency. That's good. I'd like to see. Tri Brigade Revolt limited. All right, Tri Brigade Revolt is not limited. That's fine, I guess. All right, semi limits. We have some semi E Telly, E Telly to two. All right, they just made Virtual Roll like one of the best decks of the format. You gotta love to see that. Gotta love to see that. You really do, really do, really do. You gotta love it. Uh, Danger Nessie and Skullcrabat Joker, fine. I think if there was any danger that was going to work its way back up to Unlimited, Nessie was probably going to be the first one. Joker, didn't don't care, didn't ask. e is really cool. There's actually some applications this card playing in Speedroid, so as a rogue player, I'm like, that's kind of cool. Mutant players, um, shout out to my friend Sheen. I'm sure he'll be happy about this. And yeah, VW just getting some really good support. And Unlimited, Double Iris Magician. So yeah, overall, this list, I kind of feel was... Uh, it was good, but also at the same time, I don't like it because Anaconda and Dragoon and Red Eyes Fusion, whatever flavor of those cards you don't like are still all at three. 
Same thing with Mystic Mind, too. I don't understand why a card like that is still legal. Um, you literally It's a card that literally punishes you for playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh, what's that? You did your turn one combo? Okay, Mystic Mind. Even though your, your end board might be like two monsters, and one of them might be a negate. Or, or monster, whatever it may be. I, I, I hate the card. I think it's poorly designed. And I will continue to complain about it. And I will continue to champion uh, for its uh, place here on this list. But... Overall, I think it's pretty good. I think each each meta deck did get a uh, decent hit to it. Um, they gave VW an extra e tally, so they get to play five copies of Lulu uh, instead of four. So that's really nice. So VW now best deck. You know, even though I still think Tri Brigade is um, probably one of the best decks of the format still. I think Drytron is still really, 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 really good. A lot of builds I already knew like. We're already playing one Eva, so the one Eva doesn't really make a difference. I honestly feel like even if Eva got banned, Drytron would still be a really, really good deck. Um, because you just end with orange lights. You end with just fairies in your hand. Um, like, sometimes the Eva, in most cases, is overkill with certain hands. Sometimes you don't even need to end on the ultimate as board. Like, you can end on Medionis, Herald of Mirage Light, and Draconids with the uh, material underneath the uh, Mubeta. Um, and then maybe even just a live orange light in hand. There's four interruptions right there. Really, really solid uh, deck still. Um, I really think it's crazy that only one card got banned and it was Barrage. Which is like actually mind-blowing to me. I think there was so much more they could have done. Um, I guess we'll have to wait till next year uh, to see if they'll actually want to address the cards that everybody's been complaining about for the longest time now. Maxi at Maxi has a zero. That's like the biggest victory. I guess we could take away from this Also, I find it interesting now that I'm looking over again. There is no hits to Shadal invoked whatsoever This deck just keeps get and called by is still at one Okay, I guess we're gonna be in a format where we have three cross out and called by the grave But like I'm actually just mind blown that magical meltdown gets to stay at three for as long as it has And Winda like that deck that deck has gone untouched like for so long now and it's actually mind-blowing to me i mean i guess we'll have to see how popular it becomes this current format as all these other decks have gotten pushed down a little bit and if you guys want to see more of my content click on one of the videos popping up on the bottom of the screen right now and of course let me know what your thoughts are on this ban list down in the comments below and as always we're gonna kill the center we'll see you guys in the next one and last but not least a special shout out goes to our divine level channel members and they are cadillac cd4 pony stark keith sidgers and daryl bass thank you guys so much for your extremely generous support